Hashtag, Hashtag we, we are, are movie, movie club. club. It's time for camera eyes. Change of scene. A bug's life. Okay, look, there are so many things I would change about this movie. There's no joke. This is not a movie that I would ever make if I were someone who made movies. This is nothing that would come out of my creativity. It's too juvenile. It's too formulaic. It's too on the nose. And it's that way on purpose because it's for kids. So, if we take away the root cause... What would an adult version of Bugs Life look like? Stop looking up insect porn! I'm being serious. I think we have to change the conflict from the ants supplying the grasshoppers and get rid of the allude to the old fable. Because, really, you can make a better movie about just that. But let's make it a little bit more realistic. The ants are trying to fend for themselves and pack it all away. But before the locusts come in and eat everything, and if the locusts don't have enough or they get caught out there, the locusts start eating the ants. And that's really the thing. That we even had somebody, like, on a harness, but nobody got bit or ate or squished, except for maybe Hopper. The circle of life. But that sort of conflict will make it so everybody in the ecosystem is affected. The birds probably won't be super happy because they ain't whatever. They'll be eating locusts when they show up. The ants will be able to like swarm and take down a couple when it comes down to it. You're gonna have dung beetles, maybe not dung beetles. Maybe you'll have spiders with you know, extra webbing to take care of these guys. If you look at it from an insect arachnid community, and you note that this is a world disaster to them, the locusts coming in, then that's a story. Maybe I've been watching too many apocalyptic movies and shows lately, but that's something that would make it interesting for me. Anyways, that's my change of scene. Thanks for watching. Be sure to go check out all the fine folks that are involved in this video. Thanks for watching.